Lee Gun Hee was the visionary behind Samsung Electronics. The transformation from a cheap appliances maker to the world's biggest producer of smartphones, televisions, and memory chips. He began relentlessly pushing the company up the technological ladder after taking to the helm in 1987, following the death of his father. Famously telling employees to change everything except your wife and your children during his drive to challenge rivals such as Sony. By the early 90s, Samsung had surpassed its Japanese and American peers to become the industry leader in memory chips, then began dominating flat panel display and high-end mobile markets soon after. The global electronics powerhouse today is South Korea's corporate crown jewel and a cornerstone of the economy, but the rise to the top had its setbacks and controversies. Lee was mired in political scandal in the late 1990s after being convicted of paying bribes to the government in 1996, for which he was pardoned a year later. In 2009, he was found guilty of tax evasion and breach of duty for intentionally causing losses at a Samsung subsidiary. Nevertheless, the reins are now set to pass to his only son, J.Y. Lee, who's been the conglomerate's de facto leader since 2014. The younger Lee is grappling with two simultaneous legal disputes with South Korean prosecutors over allegations of bribery and corruption which he's repeatedly denied. Still, J.Y. Lee is expected to eventually inherit the $300 billion company that continues to be one of the world's leading electronic players.